like Chantley said, we'll record this here for you guys. This is an extreme bull buy setup. This is exactly what we did, uh, talked about last night in the conference call for 45 minutes. How to anticipate this move before it happens. So what I was doing on the microphone, I said we're looking for an extreme, I'm mean, looking for a, a buy setup above the shallow retracement if this oscillator holds. If we get pulled in, so what you want to do is you want to, let me mark this up here for you. What you want to do, I can see the market's moving up. We had a price insufficiency, price is moving up hard. And if you don't understand this, play the conference call last night, how you can use Chart Trader to fire in this trade or use automation to turn your automation on. You can see that we are in a shallow retracement. We are above or shallow. I had a big gap in between my order blocks, between 60 to 86. So we had 26 points of nothing but upside. My first target was price profile that I was talking about if we get pulled in, which is 76 and a half. I believe that was the high to the tick. Yes, high to the tick, 76 and a half. So the pull in was here at this level, 71. My first target was 76 and a half. I said if we get pulled in here, which we did, the reason I said to look for this buy setup before it happened, I could see the oscillator was pegged above 80. So I got on the microphone, said look for a pull in. Target would be 76 and a half. And then here's your ultimate gap in the market between order blocks, 60 to 86. So that's called an extreme buy, bull buy setup. Because as long as you stay above 40 on this pullback, on this oscillator, and you are above the shallow retracement, that is two characteristics that is a winning recipe for a high probability trade setup. So that audible went off on your computers, those that you leased a program, your audible alert came off when that arrow fired, that was your entry. And the beautiful thing about it is some of my best setups that I look at is when you are pegged above 80 on a pullback on the bull. This is called an extreme bull buy setup. I went over this conference call, like I said, 45 minutes last night. That's the exact setup. So I'm showing you how you can see this before it happens. I start talking about this at 8.30 all the way, and we had a whole hour before this setup even came up, a whole hour to prepare for this pullback extreme bull buy setup. And what you do is when the oscillator is pulling back, as long as there's a pullback below, you're 40, you're good to go. Now, what you can do, like I said, is you can use automation with indicator. What automation with indicator is, is that you can use your automation. So let's go into automation real quick and let's put a, our trail. Let's say you want this thing to trail. outside of our shallow retracement the 36 and you can have this all preset and so when I was looking for that pullback and that oscillator was holding and I was above the shallow retracement you can toggle this on you can turn your automation on and it's still the runner is still running so your runner's still running so you can see you can use the indicator with automation and that's what we went over last night how to use the indicator with automation and have price targets order blocks are extremely important order blocks are big support and resistance levels based upon where the market has rallied hard or sold off hard and gives major supply and demand support and resistance so you can see order block held here order block held here and then the next order block is the target but as you can tell, as we move up, when you have a price insufficiency that I went over last night in a conference call, price is moving up hard. This is when I got on the microphone and said, hey, look for the 20. It's setting up for a buy before it happened. So what, as soon as you see that first doji, or because market can only do two things, it can give us a continuation, double doge continuation, or it can give us a pause in the market of retracement. You can turn on your automation. The entry was 60, 71. 
and the high was 86 on a potential move all the way to 86 and the runner still running um, and you can have that preset or if you don't want to use automation the indicator fired an audible alert right here at 71 on your computer and you know it's a ex extreme high probability trade because my oscillator is pegged above my extreme bull that's my favorite trade in the room I go over this all the time and there we go that's how we do it all right the smaller time frame we did have some setups earlier right here is our extreme bull we had to sell off earlier when we rolled over we had pegged south three extreme sell set, sell setups but this caught the buy setups earlier than 71 that is 66 and a quarter and that entry audible alert on your system was 69 a quarter and that high potential is all the way to 86 that's 20 s p points off the 113 that the bull buy setup got so if you don't understand how and why this setup came up i gave a big heads up on the setup we've been stalking this trade worked out exactly how we talked about it last night in the conference call so uh, play that conference call and uh, last night you guys get a, will be good to go